The first memories I have from out trips at SMU was going to Camp Thunderbird in grade seven. I really remember a lot because it really bonded me to my friends because we got to stay in cabins overnight. So you really got to get to see what it was like being away from home and staying with, and staying with your friends for like four nights. My first family out trip was grade 10 when I first came here. It was about two weeks into school. I really didn't know anyone. I uh, ended up going on sea kayaking. It was about my sixth choice. I really didn't know what to expect. Never sea kayaked before, uh, but it was about a five day trip. We launched out of Sydney and we went to Darcy Island. We were supposed to go to Rum Island in Portland as well. Ended up getting stormed in, which really didn't end up being that bad. We ended up playing cards, doing a couple day trips. And I really talked to people I would never have talked to before. And I got to meet some people, you know. I had some friends coming out of it, so it was basically a good trip. When I first heard of outdoor leadership, I thought that it was more for people who were really outdoorsy, really like into sports and really active. But um, so I thought it wouldn't be something that I was interested in. But when I was in grade 10 geography, Mr. McLeod was actually my teacher and he had suggested to my parents that I take it. So I looked into it more and asked a few of my friends and they said, like, oh no, it's not that. It's like, you actually get to go on out trips and learn how to lead a group. And it's, it's a really interesting course. So I thought, yeah, I'll try it out, see how it goes. So in grade 10, I had uh, two guys on my trip that were grade 12s, outdoor leaders. And uh, they were basically really chill guys. They showed me the ropes of basically kayaking, doing everything. And <laughs> basically they talked to me and they were like, you should really do outdoor leadership. It's a great experience. You get, you get credits for it, which is awesome. And you get to just do out trips, teach other kids what you know, you know. I was very pleasantly surprised by my first out trip that I did because it gave me so many memories and it actually gave me a lot of confidence that I didn't have before because suddenly I knew that, wow, I actually can hike up a mountain with a big heavy pack. I never thought I could do that before. Well, it's, it's definitely the leadership aspect of it. Like, they put you in that role whether you like it or not. They really say, you're leading today, you're gonna do this, you're gonna do this. And for kids who aren't comfortable with it, like, I, was, I wasn't that comfortable with it at all. But by coming out of it, I was, in life even, I will take charge, no, like, no question in mind. And it's just, yeah, overcoming those goals you didn't think was possible. And, I mean, raises my expectations of life, and that really pushes me to succeed. Line by 